to the video. In this chapter, we will learn about how are clouds formed. Clouds are formed when water vapors are converted into liquid water droplets by the process called condensation as the air becomes cool. These tiny droplets remain floated in the air and appear as clouds. You hang out the wet clothes out in the sun and when you come back, it's dry. You set out a container of water for birds to drink and when you look again after some times, the level of water decreases even when there is no bird visitor. The water from wet clothes and container gets evaporated. The evaporation is the process by which the liquid water gets converted into gaseous form called water vapour and goes into the atmosphere. Water from larger reservoirs or water bodies such as lakes, rivers, ponds, oceans, pools, etc. also gets evaporated and adds to the atmospheric air in the form of water vapour. When water absorbs heat energy from the sun, the molecules become energetic and escape from the liquid phase into gaseous phase. The warm air starts to rise above because the warm air is lighter and less dense than the air present around it. When the air containing water vapour rises further, it cools down and converts it to form tiny water droplets. The process of conversion of water from gas to liquid phase is called condensation. The tiny particles such as dust, microorganisms, salt crystals from sea, etc. floating around air helps in the process of condensation. These particles act as a catalyst and provide surface for the process of condensation. These tiny water droplets remain floating in the air and appear as clouds. The tiny water droplets in the cloud join together to form bigger water droplets. The windy movement causes the cloud particles to collide with each other. As they become heavy, they form rain-bearing clouds. The process of condensation plays an important role in bringing water back to the Earth's surface. Only certain amount of water vapour can be held by the air depending on the temperature and moisture present in air. Clouds are formed by different ways. Some clouds are formed when air near the Earth's surface warms up and rises above. Some clouds are formed when the wind blows in the side of mountain range. Clouds are also formed when air is moved upwards at the areas where atmospheric pressure is low. Now, it's the time to explore it by doing yourself only. In this video, we have learnt about how are clouds formed. In the next video, we will learn about the new things. I will take your leave. Till then, bye-bye and stay happy.